Hey everyone, we just launched a big enhancement to our drop-down selector for uh, things like inputs, variables, and filters. So not only does it look a lot cleaner, uh, but it's much more intuitive and will even auto-complete based on uh, the values that you're entering in. Uh, so for example, I'll go ahead and give you a quick um, example. So if I go to data manipulation, go to create variable, um, here you can see it says text, but if I just started typing in some numbers, um, it would automatically detect that that's an integer. If I put a period in there, it knows it's a decimal. All of a sudden, if I go back to uh, letters, it'll go back to text. Um, I could do something like false. It'll know it's a Boolean, et cetera, et cetera. So definitely very intuitive. It even does it with variables. Um, so very nifty. You can even um, just start immediately writing uh, JSON or array right into this text line instead of going all the way to the import JSON. Um, so for example, if I just write in a basic array here, I'll say one, two, three, four, um, it's going to go ahead and know that I wanna put uh, some JSON in there and I can just go ahead and hit import and it'll just explode it out for me um, as you would hope. Um, also, we overhauled this subpath. So for example, if I wanted to go ahead and create a new variable and look for the subpath in my user table, uh, which I've already copied, um, but if I just went ahead and paste this and hit define and go ahead and expand this, um, we get this nice clickable view this time. Um, so you get the full view of uh, that subpath that you want. So if I wanted to drill all the way down into uh, name of this uh, user two here, I could just simply click that button and Xana will write out uh, the dot notation for me to get that path exactly how I want it. Um, in the filters, um, if we go ahead and look at this, much cleaner view. Um, the searchability is um, much faster. So nice overhaul, should save you guys a lot of time. Um, excited for you guys to play around with it and hear your feedback. So uh, thanks for watching.